boom, you get your charging port. And what I love about this is you have this little guided light. Check this out, guys. Oh man, get in here. I'm gonna give you guys a little sneak peek. Take a look at this interior. All right, anyways, we'll get back to that later. I'm gonna press this Cadillac badge right here to bring this down. This is the Cadillac of the future, but it's coming pretty soon. It's called the Celestic. My favorite part of the back are these huge taillights on the sides. I mean, when have you ever seen this on a car? All right, let's go over to the side right there. Nothing suspicious, right? But if I press this, boom, you get your charging port. And what I love about this is you have this little guided light just to kind of help you out in case you can't see it, but it looks great. I think it's, I think it's in a really nice touch. All right, over here, what you have it's like an homage to some of the more classic Cadillacs from the 30s and 40s. This was the goddess that you used to see up there in the front. They just kind of put that on there, which I think is a pretty cool touch. All right, to close it, just press it like that. You see this? Side view cameras. But what I want to show you guys is the length of this car because this car is one foot longer than a Cadillac Escalade. It's over 18 feet long. I mean, look at this thing. It's huge. So take a look at the front. You have all of these lines going on underneath this glass panel. It looks amazing. And when you walk up to the car, you get this kind of light dance. You see how the lights stack up on the sides? That is sick. So this thing will actually have a frunk. I mean, this bonnet is pretty huge. It will have a frunk on top of the batteries. And I love how clean it looks in general. You have so many different materials. You have this glossy black with some ribs underneath it. You have kind of the glass going on in the middle. You have this kind of aluminum right there with the gray. A lot of stuff going on, but it looks very, very futuristic. Again, this car will be coming out in the next few years. Take a look at it from the side. Like, I love this angle of the car. Look at that. I mean, that is just an awesome looking car. These rims, by the way, these are 23 inch rims. Remember back in like the 90s when rappers would brag about like having 20 inch rims? Well, now you get 23s and standard. All right, so on the side, no door handles, right? So how do you open them? Right here, you have this little touch button, the shape of a line, just press that. And there you go. You are welcomed into the back of your brand new Cadillac. All right, take a look at that. How beautiful does this interior look, man? I mean, this is just, you have all this red with the red stitching as well, all in like an arrow shape going to the front. Everything that looks wood is wood. You see that right there? So this thing has five different HD LED screens. Two of them are on the back of the seats right here. This is touch screen, but you can also control your climate with this little toggle right here. And this also has the Cadillac goddess that we saw earlier before. And look how elegant everything looks. This right here is actually also an homage to some of the earlier Cadillacs as well. And you have more of that wood grain here. And you can see that there's some speakers. It's perforated. I also want to talk about the enormous panoramic sunroof. I mean, look at this thing. All right, going over to the front. To close it, actually, I can either do this or I can just pull this up like that. That's pretty sick. All right, so the front. Everyone wants to see the front, right? Same deal, press that in. And there you go. That is your driver's seat. And take a look at that steering wheel. Wrapped in leather, you have the piano black finish as well. Now, the craziest part of the front is you have a 55 inch uninterrupted glass display, which will show you everything. It's from your gauge cluster to your infotainment system. On the inside, what you also have is this really nice little red rug. Very minimalistic, but looks very sleek, very clean. Also, I love the leather that you have going end to end with no, there's nothing like you know, kind of going on over here apart from the huge glass panels, so it's not very cluttered. This right here is a huge AC vent, also very elegantly incorporated in there. It's almost not even visible, like you wouldn't really think that's an AC vent. It looks very minimalistic, at the same time it looks very futuristic, like the steering wheel. Again, the steering wheel is very simple, it looks very clean, very new, very futuristic as well. They haven't overdone it. You know, some people they get kind of like carried away, they start throwing like different lights and stuff and it looks a little bit too much. These guys just made it happen and it looks great. I mean, yeah, again, 
This glass panel is insane. When you look backwards, I mean, do you see this? This is crazy. You have all of this and it goes all the way to the trunk of the car. I mean, this is like right here. We're talking about like probably like 14 feet of pure glass from this windshield all the way to the end. These are actually your side view cameras right there. And you can also see it right there. But this is one thing that might not actually make it to production. But the craziest part of this car is that what you see is what you're gonna get. This is gonna be like 95% going into production. A lot of times you guys see a super crazy looking prototype or a concept car and it just looks cool but you know it's never gonna actually hit the streets. This thing will. What you see right here will be on the road in a few years and it's gonna look exactly like this with just a few minor differences like the side view camera, which is kind of a shame because look at it. I mean, this does look super, super cool, but obviously regulations right now, they still don't allow for this kind of stuff. Maybe we'll see it in the future. This car is gonna cost around $300,000. It's not official. Nobody from Cadillac has confirmed this. It is gonna be around that price range and it's gonna be super bespoke. So you're gonna be able to change the inside, the outside. If you have any kind of specific material, like let's say like a tree from your childhood, front yard or something that you want to incorporate in there they'll be able to uh, sit down with you and see if they can make it happen and to be honest this is one of the best looking cars that i have seen period like when you see it in person it looks like something that does not even belong in the year that we're in right now and if you look closely right here you have a cadillac beacon so this is a light that's actually going to welcome you when you walk close to the car because you might not even have a key. They might actually just let you open the car with your phone. So when you get close to the car, you just walk nearby. It'll notice that you're around and the beacon will light up which I think is a very nice little touch. So anyways, that's the Cadillac Celestic. What do you guys think? What's your favorite angle of the car? Because the back looks incredible, the front looks incredible, the side looks incredible. What part of this car is your favorite? I think that the back and the tail lights are probably mine, I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. Like the video, subscribe to the channel, and we'll see you guys next time.